Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I, <laughs> look at these brows, they're conspiracy brows. Today, we are reviewing the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson Conspiracy Palette. We have the mini controversy palette. We got the lip gloss. I don't have anything else from it, so <laughs> that's what we got. We uh, look at these brows. They're matching the box, period. <laughs> I'm super excited to review this palette. So if you want to see me use this palette and come up with something, then Keep on watching. First off, this palette is so pretty. Look at this palette. It's so pretty. Like you're literally, in the series, I was looking at it and all the first round, I was like, mm, it's just a regular old rectangle. And then this, when they showed this, girl, I'm shook. It's raised right here. If you can see it, it's raised out. The triangle in the middle is like metal. Like the Shane Dawson part, this part's like metal. It feels really pretty. It has these clamps or buckles or whatever you would call them. Then you open it. I did notice um, that, oh, I gotta tear this thing off. This is my favorite thing to do. All right. Um, I did notice that this palette opens easier than the Blue Blood and the Blood Sugar. Um, it opens very smoothly. Here are the colors inside the large controversy palette. Very beautiful colors inside of there. And then next we have the mini controversy palette. This palette has nine shades in it. It's real small. The packaging, super cute. It has like the reflection, mini controversy, open it up. Oh. Here are the colors for the mini. There you go, you can see it. You can see it easier like that. Um, that is the mini. I'm not gonna use the mini today. We can save that for another video. Let me know in the comments if you wanna see me use the mini. Today we're gonna be using the Big Daddy. So if you wanna see the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson Conspiracy Palette, then keep on watching. <laughs> Starting off with priming my eyelids with the Anastasia Eyeshadow Primer. All right, to start out this look, I'm going to be taking the shade that I wanted to reach in the most, and that is the yellow called Food Videos. And I'm gonna start with that in my crease. And I'm using this on a Morphe M573 brush. <laughs> The first little swipe of the brush didn't really show up very well. All right, so there is the light layer of the yellow. So what I'm noticing is in real life, it's a little more bright than it is on the camera. Um, but other than that, there's no issues blending it out, not really any fallout. There's a little tiny bit of kickback in the pan, but that's literally not even a problem, like not even a little bit. Um, I don't mind that at all. So, there's that shade. I'm gonna be using the same brush in the shade Pigment. It's this pink right here. The little pig indented in it. And I'm gonna do that on the outer crease with the same brush that I just used for the yellow. I'm falling, tell me why I'm falling. Oh, life's calling, but it's hard because I'm falling. Shade that looks super pretty. Um, again, it's blending out super easy, just like the yellow shade. Um, it shows up more, but that's just probably because it's a darker shade. Um, I so <laughs> I already know Jeffrey Shadows are the bomb.com. I have literally every single palette that he's ever came out with, so yeah, I already know the Jeffree Star formula. Next, I'm gonna take this smaller blending brush and I'm gonna be dipping into Cheese Dust, which is this orange, and I'm just gonna deepen up the outer crease. And I'm also gonna drag it on the end, um, right under the yellow, but still in the crease on the inner corner. I'm falling, tell me why I'm falling. 
Next, um, I think I'm just gonna take the black called my rights here and I'm gonna deepen up the inner or the outer corner and really smoke it out for the whole outer corner. And then we will add the Diet Cola Silver in the inner corner. Right off the bat, the black is super pigmented with a lot more kickback, I feel, with than all the other shades. So you really gotta have to be careful with this one so your look doesn't turn into a black hole. Next, I'm gonna be adding Diet Cola into the inner corner with a little Sephora brush. Um, I'm gonna try to do it just plain and then if it's not really that bright, I'm gonna add some setting spray and apply it with that. Falling, falling, falling. That is super pretty. I'm living for this look. It is so pretty. Sorry, I forgot to push record, of course, but I'm taking pigment again and I'm sweeping it um, in the outer corner of the lower lash line. And I'm really just making sure it connects up with the top outer corner. Very that, very that. All right, and then going in with food videos, the yellow in the inner corner. All right, and now I'm gonna take some of the, um, I'm gonna take a little bit of the orange again, the cheese dust, and sweep that right here in just the middle and just kind of tie the two together. Then I'm gonna just slightly tap the black and sweep it on the very tip of the lash line. Ooh. To finish off this look, I'm gonna be taking Ranch, which is the shimmery white shade in the upper corner. And I'm gonna add that to the inner corner. Ooh, I love, love, love that. I'm gonna be right back and pop on a lash and mascara, and then we'll come back and try out the lip gloss, and then that'll be pretty much it. So. Um, just one second, keep on watching. All right, everyone, this is the look with the lashes on. The last thing we need to do is the gloss. Um, this is Shane Glosson. I literally, when I was watching the series and heard that name, I cracked up laughing and I was like, that is so perfect. <laughs> but the gloss looks like this, very cute packaging. Um, the top in real life isn't as black. It's more of like a chrome black color, um, but in camera it does look black. Um, the other Jeffree Star lip glosses don't say the gloss on them, but this one does. Um, but it's just a clear gloss, so we're gonna give that a try. It smells exactly like Ruby, or like exactly like it. And on my lips, I'm wearing Jeffree Star I'm Nude, my all-time favorite liquid lip. It's the same formula as his other lip glosses super super comfortable not sticky at all very very comfortable on the lips look at that shine look how pretty that is it's so pretty all right everyone that is all for the video um everything worked perfectly normal and good just like um jeffree star's products really always do um i have no really complaints on it this look i am living it's so pretty the lip gloss super comfortable really shiny super pretty everything about this is really good congratulations to shane and jeffree on such a huge launch because over a million palettes in a few minutes girl that is everything for this video. If you watched the entire video, comment the word gloss, G-L-O-S-S. -S. And if you liked the video, go ahead and give it a like, subscribe to my channel, little button that looks like this. And that is all for this video. So until my next one, bye.